Almost three years after passing medical cannabis legislation, no patients have benefited from it. Legal battles continue to hold up the process. One lawmaker has proposed increasing the number of licenses awarded. Senate Bill 276 would allow the Alabama Medical Cannabis Commission to issue six licenses for processors, seven for dispensaries, and triple the number of integrated facility licenses to 15. We asked bill sponsor Senator David Sessions how this would actually remedy the issue as companies would still be denied and more lawsuits could come. I think a lot of people will wind up realizing they shouldn't have applied for a license to begin with. I don't think you'll have a lot of people pushing uh, above that. Uh, I think if you got, if you had a total of 12, I, I doubt you'd have much more litigation or, or litigation that had merit. During a public hearing, many medical cannabis license applicants spoke against the bill, believing it would saturate the market, lessen the value of standalone cultivators, dispensaries, and processors, and is unfair for applicants to choose a different path, not knowing more licenses would open up. No vote was taken on the bill today.